looking at this house today. Funny thing about this house, it belongs to the realtor that sold us our house, where we live at now. And I met her, because I was out looking at houses one time with my wife, and she was selling houses. And I started talking to this and that. Well, a guy had painted the outside of her house, but never finished it. And like three months later, she couldn't get a hold of him. So she called me and I came and finished it for her and stuff. And that was, I don't know, four or five years ago before, before she even sold us our house. But, uh, so now we're painting the inside. And she's painting it the same color. But we're doing the ceilings. So once again, the ceilings here were like yellowish. We're painting them white. And the walls are the same color that they already are. And then uh, Hector's back here. We're painting everything here. We're gonna, it's a really pretty house. It's got a really big farmhouse style. But Hector's in here painting this ceiling. What's this? You mean? Yeah. I don't want to see this. Oh, no, yeah, it's time. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, andale. How was your birthday? Oh, very good. What did you eat? Eat. What did you eat? Oh, the garden. Did you like it? Sí. Y comida me mexicana. Mexican food. Sí. Y no sé dónde vas a ir, qué concierto vas a ir. Oh, voy a ir a Maná. Sí. Maná, ¿de dónde te dieron este? Este sábado 20 y algo, 20 qué? Oh, ya, ya viene entonces. Sí, este es mes. No, está bien. ¿Estás sí. ¿Está suave? Ah, después le voy a seguir dando ya. Sí, de... So I gotta spray some stuff. I'm gonna close this room up. She wants me to spray this right here. She wants me to spray all this because I think, I don't know, when they painted before, I don't know. It doesn't look bad, but she just wants me to paint it, so I'm gonna paint it for her. It's going good. Through the ceilings. Did that wall, did that. And uh, they're replacing all the floors here, so we didn't really cover the floors. We don't even mess or anything, but they're replacing the floors here like next week, so. It's going good. Second coat, we did two coats on everything. Everything got two coats. There's Mr. Hector working hard. We're done for today. We had a great day. Very pleased with what we did today. And, uh, We'll be back tomorrow. I want to try to get this done by Thursday. I'm not 100% sure we'll be able to do it by Thursday, but I'm sure going to try. Um, we'll see what happens. Um, Thursday is the day I want to finish. If not, we'll just come back Friday, but I would like to finish Thursday. We'll see. I'm going to go go to Panera Bread and get me a coffee. And then I'm going to buy Noah something. He's not, uh, he didn't go to school, so. I'm gonna get us some Chick-fil-A or something. I haven't pulled out the camera all day. I've been busy. Hector called me last night that he might not go to work today. Uh, his son had a, some uh, an issue with his car out of town and he was able to help him. So I came in with the mentality that I had to accomplish what I wanted to accomplish today. So I had to uh, paint the li uh, living room and great room area and kitchen ceilings and walls I did great and then I uh, cut all the upstairs ceilings so I had a great day I actually came in a little bit late I got here at 8 o'clock and it's 3 o'clock and I'm just leaving now so I had a great day I'm very happy with what I accomplished today but uh, now I gotta go to the Apple store I had bought a new phone and I said it had to last me two years and not even a month into having it, the screen cracked. So I set up an appointment at the Genius Bar to go get my uh, screen replaced. Luckily, American Express is going to pay for it because uh, I, pay, I pay with my American Express card for everything. So I got protection on that. But oh well for my phone lasting two years without a problem. So I'm going to do that today. We'll see. Should have a good afternoon. Good morning. Mornings are starting to be beautiful. Not too cold. And uh, 
I just love when springtime arrives because it reminds me of when I met Erika. Oh, it was a beautiful time. Um, so I went to the Apple store yesterday to get my iPhone fixed. And I checked in and everything. And they say, oh yeah, sit over there. And I was sitting there waiting for someone to help me. The guy walks out. He goes, what can I help you with? I say, my, uh, my screen, my screen cracked. I was all right, let's run some diagnostics on it. He says, and uh, we'll take it back to get it fixed. He says, can you take off your case? I took off my case. He says, oh yeah, the screen protector. I said, yeah. He goes, is it cracked or is it the screen protector that's cracked? I said, I don't know. So I took off the screen protector and it was just a screen protector that had cracked. I was like, oh man, that's cool. Oh well, I felt kind of stupid, but <laughs> oh well. Uh, I I didn't want to take off the screen protector because I didn't want to crack more. So eh, it worked out. So now I'm off to work. I don't know if Hector's going to be there because he was messing around with the son's car. He towed it from California yesterday. So we'll see. We'll see what happens. Okay, have a good afternoon. Thank you. We had a great day today. Time to go home. My tire's flat a little bit. I'm gonna get it fixed. Uh, I gotta stop by and pick up some medication for Junior. We had a great day today. We did more than I thought we were gonna do. So, I had this job scheduled for five days and we're gonna finish it in four, even with Hector being off yesterday oh we just had a great day very very happy too much haven't haven't recorded too much today but <clears throat> we're basically done and we were walking out and we had a new accident well we're done at the house <clears throat> you gotta come back to do touch-ups but after you do the floors and stuff and Hector's behind me over there and we're gonna go put gas in take them to go put gas <clears throat> 
but we had a we've had a really good week very productive i'm very happy now we're driving to bagas gasolina well hector and i went to go put gas and when i was putting uh fuel in she sent me a text message to uh come back she was gonna pay me Oh, that's my favorite part of the day, I said. <laughs> getting paid. I love getting paid. <clears throat> so I went back, and now she wants me to paint. Uh, it's like a desk area. It's pretty nice what she wants to do. She wants to paint it black, but the desk, the top, she wants me to sand that down completely and leave it like natural wood. It's going to look really, really nice. It's going to look really pretty. But I think we're going to do it next week. So I got to send her a quote real quick. I just like putting everything in writing. I can give them, a, I can give people quotes right there on the spot, but I like to put things in writing so people know what we're using and you know what's included, and so like that. There's no questions later. So I'm gonna go home and give write up that estimate, and but I'm gonna go to the bank first because that makes me happy. Going to the bank, I love going to the bank. It's my favorite part. Well, good morning. I'm out and doing stuff right now. Kind of, uh, uh, not working, but I came to the shop to get some stuff done. And it's not, I just clean up and stuff and clean my truck. And I'm uh, just doing stuff. We didn't work today, so um, I gotta go to the bank and go get me some coffee. Not much going on today. I got a guy, I painted his house. I painted his house about a year ago. And now the HOA wants him to, he, he, he's a corner lot. And uh, the what, he's a corner lot and one outside wall, it's like, I don't know, it's like 70 feet, 80 feet maybe. Maybe longer, it's, it's a big wall. And the HOA is asking him to paint him paint it but he called me uh wanting me to paint it but he he wants me to do it for free because uh i painted his house and he's texting me saying that he's getting fined by the hoa and this and that but that's not part of the paint job it's it's a street it's a big street facing wall and i mean if it should have been painted originally well he should have had me paint it when I painted his house and I would have charged him for it, but I don't know. Sometimes people try to take advantage of me. But I'm gonna tell him, hey, well, I thought it was just a little piece. He told me it's just a small retaining wall. And I was like, well, you know, I painted his house a year ago. If he buys me the paint, I'm right there, I'll just go do it, you know. Um, I thought maybe it was you know, a re the small retaining wall is like a two foot two foot wall or whatever instead of it's two feet by whatever you know it's a small small little wall i might be able to even do it with the leftover paint that was there that i left there but he, he, he needs about five five to six gallons of paint i'm not gonna go buy that i mean that's not my responsibility anymore so i'm dealing with that but we'll see i'm out with this guy today yeah i'm out with my dad today we're going out a couple places he's got a he's gonna go get some blood drawn yeah. and then I want to go by my nose because Erika made some uh, she made some paintings some little paintings and I want to I want to hang them but I want to I want to make little frames for them uh, so it's just a little craft project she she was trying to do paintings like to put around the house like instead of buying them she wanted to do them herself and we, she bought some small ones just to see how they looked and stuff, and they turned out really pretty. So I'm gonna hang them, and then uh, she got two more big canvases to do a couple more. And then if those work out, I told her I want to make, I want her to make some big ones for the hallways. So she's making her own, her own stuff. So I gotta go buy some wood for that, and then I gotta stop by my parents' house to pick up a miter saw I have there. And I'm gonna go out to dinner tonight with my parents. I'm gonna take them out. We're gonna take them out to uh, Texas Roadhouse. Okay. Texas Roadhouse. 
Yeah. How's your week going? It's going good. Uh, Friday came by really fast. Yeah? Really fast. Noah didn't go to school all week. No. He had a concussion. How, how do you think he's doing? I think he's, he's feeling a lot better than, than the day after when it happened or even the day of. But um, he got me really worried. I was at my grandparents' house when, when my mom called me and I was like, oh God. He's been getting which is good. So off to the vampire place. <laughs> the vampires suck suck blood, yeah, right? Yeah, that's true. Actually at the hospital, when we were at the when Junior was in the hospital, they the the people who draw blood, they their scrubs are, are red. <laughs> really? Yeah. <laughs> so that's funny. I can go over here now. Good morning, it's Sunday. Didn't do much Friday. Did a couple of things Friday. Um I've been working on, on this in my garage. Erika, Erika made these paintings and I made these frames uh, over the weekend. So I'm gonna hang them. Look nice. This is gonna look really cool. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hang them. They're gonna be in Noah's bathroom. She's gonna make a couple of other ones. And hey, it looks nice. I gotta go to Costco right now, and then I might go get a haircut, because I need it. And then I'm gonna go to my mom's house a little bit later. And then we're gonna call it a day. So about a month ago, I bought a shop vac for, uh, for, for, to use for grinding floors and stuff. And I really wanted a HEPA vac. And when I came to Lowe's, they didn't have one, but the guy said, oh, this one will work just fine, this and that. And I told him, well, you know, it's kind of fine dust. He says, oh, it's going to work. You have double filters and a bunch of stuff, he said. So I bought it. He says, hey, if it doesn't work out, just bring it back. So I used it, and I wasn't really happy with it. And then uh, I pulled it out yesterday again to try to do some stuff around in the garage and it just it it clogged the filter is always clogged because the, the dust is too fine so i gotta figure something else out so i can't return that one the nice thing about like these these stores like lowe's and home depot i don't return stuff just to return stuff you know but if it doesn't work hey well they take it back so i'm gonna go put on some some meat i'm gonna smoke today and then i gotta go to costco my favorite store I have two major problems. <laughs> I really love going to Costco. <laughs> and I really love cooking. I love trying new things, man. This past week I made this chicken. Oh my goodness. It was really good. And then uh, today I'm doing, I've done this one before. It's a chuck roast, but I'm gonna cook it like a brisket to about 205 or so. But at 160, I put it on a foil pan and I put onions on the bottom and let the juice sauce all, ooh, it's gonna be good. And then I'll make little barbecue sandwiches. It's gonna be good. Let's see that. I just love cooking. I love trying new things. Turn that way. How are you? Hey, good. Where are you going? We are going to uh, Nana Reina's house and to Home Depot. How's the day going so far? It's going good. How were your pancakes this morning? Tell me. Oh, last week's were the best ones I've ever had. Well, today's beat last week, so today's have been the new best ones I've ever, ever had. They're good, huh? Yeah, they're really good. Whatever you and I are doing, we're doing it. Yeah. Yeah. Gotta go to mom's house. Gotta record a couple of things and and I go to Home Depot. The Home Depot. So we're all done here. Working on some a little project. And so now I'm gonna go home and I'm gonna check on that meat and see how it's going. Yep. What's up? Nothing much for going home. Yeah. They want you to come stay here. Yeah. yeah. I think they missed me. Yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah, but the, uh, I think I'm I'm not gonna go out, come to the house to see him until no goes back to school. Yes, no. Uh, yesterday all day he didn't make some. So. Yeah, so fun. Your partner? Yeah. Partner in crime. This is what I made today. They're called armadillo eggs. Jalapeno stuffed with cream cheese wrapped in uh, ground beef and then wrapped in bacon and then sauced up with some barbecue sauce. Beautiful. Well, I think that's it for this video. Uh, I'm not going on this next week, so got like three jobs. So stay tuned for the next one. We'll see you.